but it's also a business. I have a phenomenal artist here, Seek One, who's going to make it a little easier for us to enjoy it. Hi, Seek One. Thanks for coming all the way from Philly to Wall Street. Of course. Thank you for having me. So looking at your stuff, how did you find your technique as an artist? Uh, it's kind of grown over time through just experimenting with uh, graffiti, photography, um, just different outlets of uh, mixed media, and you know, it's, it's changing every single day. I love the colors you use. It almost reminds me of natural light. It will look beautiful in an office, in an apartment with high ceilings. How did you choose that, and what does it look like up close and personal? So, like I said, it, it changes over time, but um, up close and personal, I would say there's a lot of details. There's a lot of things you don't just see in the Instagram pictures. So, uh, I suggest all my followers go to galleries and see my work in person to really get the full experience. I love Endless Summer. I was, I was scoping your Instagram. How do you pick what to paint? I see you're doing a lot of celebrities. Yeah, I kind of just... Um, whatever pops into my head. I could be walking down the street and something catches my eye, or it could be something from a past memory or even something that's in my life every day. Like recently I've been doing paintings of shoes, for instance, and I've been getting a lot of um, notoriety from that. Cool. What do you want people to take away from your art? Uh, I just want them to enjoy it. I want them to, you know, have it as a, a piece in their collection that they can enjoy every day for the rest of their life and um, have it be a timeless piece for all ages. And, and that's the thing, you know, some people, they don't want to collect art as an asset right so you're making that easier for us to enjoy it how are you doing that i am so i'm venturing into the e-commerce business so with that i'm selling my designs basically so before i started painting i make the image digitally and i have hundreds of images that i don't i didn't know what to do with so i made a website and i'm having them printed on canvas for a lower cost to the consumer for people who can't necessarily afford a thousand dollar painting Sure, and so it makes it easier to enjoy your stuff. How do you pick what to put out there? Uh, like I said before, anything that kind of catches my eye or inspires me. It could be uh, Frank Sinatra, it could be a uh, clothing item, it could be a Christmas tree. <laughs> Maybe it could be this right now. It could be, you never know. Why not? Whatever inspires you. So, Seek One, how do we get our hands on this? This sounds so cool. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, follow my Instagram at Seek One Art, and also the new website for e commerce is B U Y S E E K O N E dot com by Seek One. By Seek One dot com. Yes. I, I like that you have that personal touch to it. What are we going to be expecting in 2019 from this? I'm working with a couple different companies. I'm venturing out into the alcohol business. I'm working on some international shows, so I've got a lot of things up my sleeve. Awesome. Well, I would love to invite you back on Wall Street to hear more about it. What do you think? Absolutely. I would love to be here. Awesome. Good luck. I'm going to buy one of those because I think that we need to have it in the modern Wall Street office. Seek One, I follow you on Instagram. What is your handle again? At Seek One Art. All right, guys. Thank you so much. We'll see you next time. Thank you.